Seton Hall University is thrilled to announce the major renovation of our University Center. We're literally tearing down walls and opening doors to invite more collaboration, engagement, and the cross-pollination of ideas in and outside the classroom. Just like our students are at the heart of our mission, the newly renovated University Center will advance the heart of our campus. We're grateful for the support of our friends and alumni which make this major undertaking possible. Seton Hall continues to lean forward and attain new heights. Go Pirates! Part of the university strategic plan really focuses on the student experience. So that means student success, engagement, and their satisfaction. So part of being a student-centered university really focuses on putting our resources behind that mission and that promise. I am so excited. I think this is really going to be a space that students are going to be enjoying for decades to come. I don't even think excited covers it because I, I just, you know, it's something that I've always been looking forward to ever since I've heard about it. And every time I hear more information about it, I just can't wait to kind of see what it comes out to be. You know, renovating the University Center and giving students spaces that they haven't seen before gives them a new sense of pride in the university. When I saw the new renovations to all the places in that building, I gasped at almost everything. And I really think that all the incoming freshmen within those years and when it's done, they're gonna be blown away just as I was. Wow, the University Center the rendering is beautiful. It looks like the heart of the campus, which is what I believe that any university center should be. One of the things that excites me about it is the 24-7-ness of it. I just know there's just a lot of friendships that's gonna take place at 12 a.m., 12 noon, and things like that. Those late night times with, you know, coffee and grinding out for an exam. The idea that I or anybody else could wander into my home at the university center and uh, feel at home, whatever the hour of the day, whatever the day of the week, so we're really committed to listening to student feedback, and that's why they were part of the design process. They told us that they really needed more places to hang out, as well as to connect with each other. There's a lot more opportunities when it comes to like extracurriculars, event space, business space, any kind of space that you think. Open spaces as well as event spaces, they're gonna be open to multicultural organizations. And that is one way that kind of fosters inclusivity. It just opens that up. I like to call it more of the land of opportunity. You know, the, the addition of that amphitheater is something that by itself will bring people to the space. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing that being used. We're also going to be having a lot of areas where you can really reinforce teaching and learning. Uh, the media room is something I'm very excited to see what can happen and creating new interviews uh, where we can bring people from sports media or other areas to, to ask them uh, their expertise. And again, it's not about the building and what we're going to be putting in there, but what's going to be happening within the building. Open spaces, open doors, flow, interconnection. Come one, come all. Together. That's who we are. Seton Hall, a place of meeting, a place of encounter, a place to become together. This is a, a pivotal moment uh, for Seton Hall and where it can take us over the next 10, 15, and 30 years. This unit renovation is not only going to be possible without our alumni and our supporters. Uh, we invite you to come, look at the space, and let's work together to see how we can move it forward so we can make an impact for our students and the entire community.